Hi everyone, today I wanted to show you this loaded bag that I just made. This is probably going to be my last Christmas one. I'm getting a little bit christmas out, I'm about ready to pack up my things, but this one turned out a lot of fun and it is loaded. Completely loaded. I really liked how this part came out. So I'm just going to open this up and show you what it's inside. This is the back side. So it's pretty from the front or the back. I think that's important. So I'll start with the back. And here I just have a, and I don't put a whole lot in the back, but I just have some Project Life cards. I have a couple of doilies. I love this one. And a, a smaller Project Life card and a little snowman. And this is all stuff from my stash. I don't think any of this was purchased this year. These are all last year's items. I think this is Teresa Collins paper. This is a Target dollar spot from last year. I think this is from Heidi Swaps last year. And I can't remember where the ephemera came from. But here we go. Oops, we lost a piece. This was right here. Take that back. Okay, so in the front pocket I have a little bag of goodies and in here is some flare that I made and I'll save that for the recipient. I also have some sequins. I also have... Oh, if I can get it out. The star. Again, that's an, a piece from Christmas's Pass, that's a Heidi Swap collection. There's also some Project Life cards. There are, this is just a snowflake and a tag. I can get them out of there. This is another Project Life card and a tag. We have a, this is just a paper clip that I made. And I put uh, just one of those fuzzy little pom poms and some sprigs of ferns on there. And then a little tag that together. And here's a snowflake. This is one of the chenille stems. stems. <laughs> and I think that's all that's in that pocket. So I'm going to keep that separated so I can get this back together. Here I just have a, I used a, this is last year's Target reindeer clip. I added some little rhinestones on there and a little foil pom-pom just to make it a little more layered. This is a Heidi Swap piece from last year. This is some red twine from the Target dollar spot I believe last year. Snowflake. Here is just some red rhinestones or epoxy dots for them. And this is just, I have that glued down and there's a doily that is glued down and another chenille stem. And I think that's all that's in that pocket. Now, this is the fun part, I think. I took a couple of ornaments and I just attached them to some straws and added some Pencil for some wands, that was kind of fun. This is a Dollar Tree ornament. Oops, I lost some of my stickers. It's a Dollar Tree ornament, and I just put that to a straw, and it's two sided. Ho, 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 or Happy Christmas, or Happy Holidays. This one I made a doily. I used a Chanel stick on there. This is a ornament. And I made the rosette, and then of course, I think that's a Martha Stewart punch. And we have a homemade tag. And another homemade tag. Super simple. This is a envelope of goodies. And I don't remember what I put in there, I think there's some ephemera. 
and this is a another envelope with some goodies and I just had that clipped on with this paper clip and then I think that was um, maybe Tuesday morning last year here is a clear envelope with some die cuts in it and I just have that fastened down with a glitter bow this is a package full of extra oh I know this is kind of fun the fixings for hot cocoa and a little Christmas bling she can add to one of her projects and a pen so that's it that's my loaded bag like I said I really like this part I thought that was fun if you'd like to make one of these I used my expanded loaded envelope cut file that works uh, with any machine that takes an SVG and I'll link the video where you can pick that up if you're interested in, in making one of these so I hope you enjoyed the video if you did please give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you soon